no mistake, no? Well, you're responsible for the jury in this country, but also... Sorry, I'm not going to speak to you on the paper. You're not going to speak to... Where would you like to speak? Okay, yeah, I'm not going to speak to you. Uh, can you invite me to come into your office to speak then about father's rights? Is that OK? Do you not want to say anything about the 200 children that lose their parents every day through courts that you administer? 200 children, Mr Justice Mumby, lose their parents unjustly. I, do you not feel responsible for the society you're creating? Right, Please, so how long have you have a conscience? I have said I do not want to speak to you. I'd be grateful but if you Mr. stop Mumby, trying to get Mr. Mumby, we pay your wages, sir. We will be you grateful. You've got responsibility sir, with your position? Okay. Sir, we would be grateful if you had a conscience for 200 children who are removed from their parents Mr. every Mumby, day. Look, Please have position. a conscience. Uh, excuse me, Mr. Sir, Mumby. Mr. Mumby. Really want, sir. Mr. Mumby, you must apply a conscience of decency. The children of this country are being destroyed. Our society is being destroyed. Our society is being destroyed by the judgments you make in your court. Mr. Mumby, do you have a conscience? Please tell me you have a conscience and you will address these matters. You're not changing? Will you please address these matters, sir? No, sir, and that, and that, is that the answer our children are Sir, can I conclude that the greatest judge in a family court is a coward? Without a conscience? Do you not have a conscience, you coward?